right. Bob DeWitt says doctors took one look at his heart and gave him a death sentence. They didn't think I'd live for another six to 12 hours. He had end-stage heart failure and needed a heart transplant, but time was running out. My left side wasn't pumping and I was just completely dying. We've been very limited in how to treat people effectively with congestive heart failure, how to extend their lives. Dr. Cedric Sheffield offered Bob something different. As part of a clinical trial, doctors implanted the HeartMate 2, a ventricular assistive device. It combines an internal pump with an external computer designed to do the work Bob's failing heart couldn't. Pumping the blood through all the organs, and that decreases the stress on the heart. See the lights in there, this is the battery here. The device serves as a bridge for people waiting for a transplant. It's also being tested as a last resort for people who are too sick to have a transplant. That is, I think, the holy grail of this entire field, is to have a, an engineering solution, a mechanical circulatory support that's equal to or better than heart transplantation for a very large population. More than a year after doctors implanted the device, Bob's back at work, feeling better than he has in years. There's no actual sensation of any kind. There's absolutely nothing that I can tell that's in there. It's designed to last up to 10 years, and Bob is grateful for every moment. I'm Melissa Medley reporting.